In this video, I'm gonna show you how to convert orthographic drawing to isometric drawing. Let's start with our isometric box. Of course, with our isometric box, we start with a horizontal line and a vertical line perpendicular to each other. Next is we're gonna draw an inclined line using the help of our 30 by 60 degree triangle. We're gonna make a 30 degree line from the intersection. And of course, another inclined line on our left side. Always remember to use light lines only. Next, we will establish our three main dimensions of our isometric box. First, we are gonna help the height we can determine our total height from our front view in our orthographic drawing. Next will be our width. We can also get our total width from our front view. And lastly, of course, our depth. You can determine the total depth from our top view. Now that we establish our three main dimensions of our isometric drawing, all we're gonna do is to project all those points with the help of our 30 by 60 degree triangle. We're gonna draw another inclined line going to the left. and another one going to the right. Now, we have our isometric box. Now, say for example, our observer is standing right in this position. The red arrow indicates the front view. Now, we will take our measurements from our front view. We'll just follow all the measurements indicated in the front view. Right, we now have our front view. Next to our front view, of course, our top view. Top view is directly above our front view. Again, all we need to do is to follow all the indicated measurements from our top view. There you go. We now have our top 
view. Of course, next to our top view, lastly we have the left side view. Again, we will just follow the indicated measurements from our left side view. And there you have it, our left side view. Now we completed all the three main views of our orthographic drawing drawn in our isometric figure or isometric box. All we have to do now is to project all the contours and all the corners from those views with the help of our 30 by 60 degree triangle. First, I am drawing all the vertical lines from all the corners from our top view going down. Then next, with the help of our 30 by 60 degree triangle, now all the corners from our front view. And now, I will use my 30 degree by 60 degree triangle to project all the corners from our left side view. Lastly, all you have to do now is to connect all the corners in our drawing. Connect all the corners from corner to corner. Here, I am using a marking pen to draw my visible lines. And there you have it, our isometric drawing. And of course, you can always clean it up and you can always erase the unnecessary pencil lines. I hope you guys learned and enjoyed our video for today. For more videos like this, don't forget to hit that like button, share with your friends, and of course, subscribe. Thank you!